We learned all about the key of C in the last module. Well, in this lesson, we're gonna talk about how the key of A minor and the key of C are related. We talked about how the key of C has seven notes and seven chords. We have the C, which is the one, D minor, E minor, F, G, A minor, and B diminished. Those are the seven. For every major key, the six is the relative of that key. So the six minor is the relative of the keys. So for every major key, there is a minor key that's related. That meaning they both have the same chords, just in a different order. No sharps or flats, because the key of C has no sharps or flats, and the A minor as well. But now we take the A minor and make it the one, and then we go from there. So we have A minor as the one, B diminished as the two, C as the three, because we go back around to C, because C, A, B, C, D minor as the four, E minor as the five, F as the sixth, and G as the seven. Same with the actual notes. If you're gonna play single notes in the key of A minor, it would be the same notes, no sharps or flats, just starting on the A. So you'd start A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Like literally the alphabet, those seven notes, and then we'd go back around to A again. In the next lesson, we're gonna talk more about what a scale is and how those actual single notes and how you can actually create music and guitar solos with those single notes. But for now, let's talk about chord progressions in the key of A minor. Typical chord progressions you might see are the A minor, D minor, E minor, A minor, A minor, F, G, C, A minor, G, F, G, A minor, you might even see A minor, B diminished, E minor, A minor, and so on. Those are chords that typically sound really good together going from one to the next to the next. In this module, we're gonna talk all about how these chords can fit with the notes so that one guitar could be playing the chords in a chord progression and the other one could be playing the notes, soloing over it and how it all fits together and how to make it sound good while doing it. If we use the right chords and the right notes together, it sounds like magic. It sounds like music. 